Let us talk about the solution of an ordinary differential equation. When it comes to an ordinary differential equation, you might end up dealing with three types of solutions. The first one is explicit solution. It means that you have a nice function on an interval and that function satisfies the differential equation. You might have a relation between variables, not necessarily a function, and that relation satisfies the ordinary differential equation. Or in some other cases, you might not be able to even find an explicit or implicit solution for ODE. So what do we do in that case? We try to graph the family of solutions and analyze the behavior using, for example, slope field or Isaac lines. Definition. Explicit solution to an ODE. Well, in this case, we have a function. Function like phi an interval i is called an explicit solution for just the solution for an ODE. Remember that this function must have derivatives. If it satisfies the equation. Well, let's take a look at one example to feel more comfortable about explicit solution. So this question asks us to determine if y equals to x squared minus 1 is a solution of this ODE, the first derivative raised to the fourth power plus one squared equals to one. Okay, perfect. We have an explicit function. It's defined on the real line, negative infinity to positive infinity. And as you can see, y is x squared minus one. y is isolated on one side and explicitly we defined y in terms of x. So is y equals to x squared minus one, a solution of this differential equation. This is an equation. It has a left-hand side and it has a right-hand side. So here you have left-hand side of the equation, left-hand side, and here you have right-hand side of the equation. Let us write down left-hand side. as y prime to the fourth plus y squared and right hand side, which is just the constant on the other side, one. We're gonna check to see if these two are equal to each other or not. So what do we need? We need to find the derivative of x squared minus one. y is x squared minus one. So y prime is two x. Recall that in elementary calculus, if you have y equals to a x to the n, the derivative is a n x to n minus one. So y prime is two x, let us substitute that here. Two x to the fourth plus y squared, what is y is x squared minus one. So let's substitute this here. x squared minus one to the second is this guy after simplification equals to one. We need to check to see if that's true. Well, here you have two to the fourth, which is 16, x to the fourth plus x to the fourth minus two x squared plus one. This is your left-hand side. On the right-hand side, you only have a constant. Well, on the left-hand side, you have an expression 
with degree four. And on the right hand side, you only have a constant. So obviously, they are not equal to each other. They are not equal to each other. So, what is the conclusion? The conclusion is y equals to x squared minus one is not the solution to the ODE, the first derivative of y, to the fourth plus y squared equals to one. What is the solution then? Later on, we're going to discuss different methods finding the solution of different types of ordinary differential equations.